Yes, sir. 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 Yes, Let's say this is the question for you and then we'll try to address it. Fine, this is the question for you, right? Okay, now what we'll yes, do? Yes, sir. So we'll apply the log in this part. This is already x is equal to 100 power a. Right? So that can be written as when you apply the log in terms of log. log of what log of x okay. to the base what yes sir base is 100 is equal to a correct i can write uh, this exponent form in the log like this correct yeah similarly i can write uh, the y part as how let's say I'll write it as log of y to the base 10,000 is equal yeah. to b right similarly I'll write like this yeah. z also I'll write it the same way so this will be written as log of z to the base 10 is equal to c fine they just it's clear yes sir okay so we got uh, log of 100 base log of uh, 10,000 base and log of 10 base right now we need to find the fine log of 10 root y yeah. and uh, by x square z square correct Now let's apply the yes, fine theorem. Okay, apply the quotient rule in the log. So this can be written as log 10 y. We can apply the root here. 10 root y minus log of x square z cube. Correct? Yes, sir x square z cube isn't it now by default the log when nothing log is there the base is 10 when the log base is not given the by default is given the base is 10 fine so here we can apply the product rule here this can be given of log of 10 plus log of y root y Correct. Got it. Minus. Yeah. We can apply here log of product rule. Log of x square. Log of x square plus log of z cube. Right, they use. log of 10 to the base 10 will be anyway 1 only this will be taken as 1 correct plus y power 1 by 2 so we can take it uh, 1 by 2 outside root y right? root y means y power 1 by 2 correct 1 by 2 log y isn't it minus you open the bracket now yeah sorry power power log of the x square will be log x plus 3 log z isn't it now we got log x log z and log y got it in terms of a b c we need to find isn't it yeah, yeah good now let's find out the you know a value 
because but we have log x to the base 100 but you have only log x to the base 10 so how to change to the base 100 now then only we can substitute so by default the base is 10 here let's say base is 10 here base is 10 here and uh, base is 10 here right yes sir. correct okay yeah perfect now we'll change the how to change it let me explain to you so this will be written as 1 plus see this is 1 by 2 now log y base 10 can be written as we want to change the base to because log y base is 10,000 isn't it so we'll change the to log of y to the base of 10,000 the whole divide by we'll change the base okay Yes, sir. Log of base is 10,000 to the 10. Got it? Minus 2 log x power 10. So, minus we can open the bracket now. So, it will become 2 log x 10. So, we want x is 100 is there. So, we want base to be changed to 100. So we can put log x by base is 100 divide by log of 10 to the base 100 correct again minus 3 minus 3 bracket oh sorry again so we'll change the logs to z is what 10 oh log 10 z we don't have to do anything so log z is already in the base 10 only so we can this base 10 only so we can replace this 3c is it we can directly replace this 3c is it because log z is given as c you getting it or not understood now let's see yeah yes sir. 1 plus 1 by 2 see log y to the base 10,000 can be written as b correct b divide by yeah what is log 10 to the base uh, 10,000 so what power of 10,000 is 10 got it so that means this can be written as 10,000 power let's say power m is equal to 10 correct so that means 10 power will be it is 4m is equal to 10 so here power is 1 so m will be equal to 4m so 4m will be equal to 1 so m will be equal to 1 by 4 correct so this uh, this can be written as 1 by 4 minus 2 log x power 100 this can be written as b log is an log f oh, sorry log x to the 100 that is written as a so you can put it as a the whole divide by same method log what is 100 power something is 10 that can be written as same thing let's say this is 100 100 power n is equal to 10 so what is this now 10 power 10 power 2 is 100 so 2n is equal to 10 so 2n is equal to 1 
So n will be equal to 1 by 2. Got it, uh, Tejas? Yes, sir. It's okay. Now, let's solve it now. Yes, sir. Can you send this? Yeah, yeah. I'll send. We haven't finished yet now. So, 1 plus 1 by 2, b 1 by 4. So, 1 by 4 will go on the top. So, what will become? Let's try to do that. Okay. We'll try to simplify it here. Now, so we can write it here as 1 plus this 1 by 2. So, 1b by 2, isn't it? This can be written as by 2. And this 1 by 4 is here. So, 1 by 4 will get flipped. So, it will get multiplied here. 4 minus 2a minus 2a into it will become 2 because it will get also flip minus 3c correct so we will cancel it now 2 2 is a 4 got it so it become 2b right so we got 1 minus yes, sir. 2b minus 4a minus 3c is the answer understood clear any questions any doubts